Hey guys, what's up? So we are playing God of War. My green screen is acting up. <laughs> I guess it's too windy or something. Where were we again in the story? Ah, there you are. I knew you hadn't forgotten me. Master Kratos, I would speak with you. So, this whole spectral squirrel business. You can shoot out your feelings into little ghosties. I suppose that is a slightly inelegant way of putting it. These spectral versions of myself are aspects of my personality that I often find distracting at best. My ability not only lets me cast them away and provide some temporary peace of mind, it also allows me to see what goes on outside the tree. Why not just go look yourself? As the eternal caretaker of the tree, I may not leave its confines, it's all part of the deal, but worth it for the immortality inside. My spectral form still allows me to see the outside world, albeit too slightly Oh, viewpoints. That's one word for it. Oh. That bitter form of yours is a nasty piece of work. Oh. I'm standing right here, you know me. Oh. <sighs> I'd apologize for him, but where would it end? Oh. Well, I'll leave you to it. To Alfheim. I think Alfheim is where we should go, right? It's good to see the stream holding up. Perhaps as we travel, you can tell me the tale of your prior visit to the land of the elves. Sure, I can. For those who are watching, hello. How fun was the first time we ever realm traveled using your temple? Freya tried coming with us, but Odin cast a spell on her. She can't leave Midgard. Oops. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of dark elves to get to the light. You interfered in the elf war. Not by choice. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. And the dark elves were covering it with their sticky hive stuff. When we freed it, the light elves came back. They seem better in Alpha. <laughs> Did they now? Alfheim. It's been so long. Not sure where the temple is from here, but that's where we'll find Groa Shrine. Is my audio okay? Aye. Not exactly an easy fix for that. I see the elves continue their war. Yeah. So much for things being better in Alpha. <laughs> <sighs> Thimble winter hit Alfheim hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Fimble winter. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm too bright. Fuck. Eh, it's 
it's okay. There we go, I think that's better, huh? There we go. At least I don't look like a ghost. really where I'm supposed to go oh wait a minute what the fuck I'll meet you on the other side. How can I untrack? Right? Here's something out there. Something big. It's in pain. Our goal is at the temple, not in the desert. There, the temple of light. Groa's shrine is at the top. Freyr never bothered returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? Aye, no. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freya's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one. <clears throat> There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight Stone. A rare material that can take millennia to form. Majestic, <laughs> isn't it? Oh! I didn't know it could do that. <laughs> oh! Very clever. That's cool. Brother! Freya's brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freya of the Vanny traveled to Alfheim, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Did you mention how that piece fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh, no. That's enough, please. We don't need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. 
follow once we're inside. Is there truly no other way? Not like they're giving us much of a choice. So your father said. I'm just naive, I suppose. I'm no. just naive. Just an optimist, old friend. Here we go, another Should puzzle. Freyr, made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A charm to ward off nightmares. In this case, players. While knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. Okay. Oh, so what do we do with this? It's protected by something. So tall. We came in from the top last time. Didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves, but it looks like it's been sealed for some time. I'll go first. Atreus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freyr was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father, now you go. Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. <laughs> the fuck? Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah, and here, you keep pushing forward. No more dark elves? Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? Hmm. What's the Dark Elf statue doing in the Light Temple? That's just how they looked before the Division. The Division? Yes. The Elves weren't always split between Light and Dark, you know. This statue depicts the Elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the Light. There's something here, like, can we shoot this? Okay. I guess not. What's that sound? No sense in spoiling the surprise. Whoa. What's the light? Ah. Ow. I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye. Fimble winter, you reckon? Of course, making the light. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After the creation of the Nine Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. 
Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus, the Light Elves were born. Should we throw? Maybe a different angle? Well done. Though I imagine our Light Elf friends will be less than pleased. Speaking of Light Elves, let me try talking to them again. They Best may... just to let these two do their thing, brother. Nicely done. Behind you, brother! Fuckers are no match. More souls. Here, they came across on light bridges. Now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. <laughs> Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some architecture. This way. Shrine away. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> he knows where you're going. different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. These elves used Alphine's light to enhance the temple, and themselves by the look of it. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. The shrine is this way, Kratos. Yeah, he knows. 
We just like to be thorough. I see. By all means. These things smell awful. Anything interesting this way? That's that's kind of cool, huh? What's in here? Is this a runic? Nice. Shall we continue? So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the Dark Elves want with it? To return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred, none more so than the light itself. Aye, the Light Elf's success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. There's more Twilight Stone up there. It's, uh, super dark. What became of Kavasia? Ripped apart by his audience. Well, one member of the audience. Well, Thor. More Light Elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. <sighs> I'll handle this. Oh there, friends. Salutations. We mean you no harm. Here, get back. Fighting. The Dark Elves want the souls and the light left alone. But the Light Elves want to keep using them. 
That's the long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? Rarely is it so simple. I'm not our place to say. This is an elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alfheim. Right. <laughs> he said as much. made a lot of these light doors. Hmm. Fortifications. Aye. None too eager to let the Dark Elves run the roost again. Angle looks right. Excellent. Let's continue our ascent, yes? Let's go. Mumia, do you understand these poems? Well, there's always meaning if you look hard enough, brother. It's all in what you bring to it. <laughs> I suppose I'll leave you to it then. to be able to move Wow. That 
was violent. I'll meet you on the other side. Tyr can really jump. This mystic doesn't see us. There's twilight stone on the ground. I wonder if we could use twilight stone against them. <laughs> Continue up this way. Awesome. Father, over here. I want to see if there's something here. Damn, another runic. I'm gonna get up there. Another chest. Just getting the hang of it. I've never seen the light elves so much control over the temple. That's on us. They must have anointed a new temple guardian. Sato Yoffa's counterpart. Dark Elf King. Yes, he's in the light now too. See? Oh, another chest. Here they come. Do what you must. Father, watch the oars! statue, these crystals. I've noticed them on the elves as well. I wonder, if this statue were to fall over the chasm... Still make light bridges. Now the light elves wear them. Smart. Almost there. Allow me. I dare say he's beginning to enjoy the vandalism. Pretty soon he'll be laying waste to pottery. Shall we continue? Well, at least we're getting closer. Look up. See? It feels even taller on the inside. I can't believe all this was down here. Ah, the Nornir. 
Why must they insist on these frustrating trials? You would know better than us, brother. I can't remember the last time I visited the Nords. Nor do I wish to try. Hey, Paul John. Yeah, Hello, man. No, not yet, not yet. Don't want to fight yet. Ah, fuck. Hey, Paul John. Thank you for sharing, man. Oh, shit. Let's go. Before we continue, oh, look, a raven. That's brighter than I remember. Let's uh, let's continue this. Let's continue this puzzle. Do I need to push this? I guess not. There's one over here. There's probably one in here. Oh, there it is. So I should do it in this order. One, two, and two. well done. Let's check anyway. Perfect.
Another light door. There's some twilight stone on that statue shield. That angle isn't gonna work. Do you think there's any way to stop the elves from fighting each other? Had Freyr not abandoned the realm, a lasting peace may have formed. But now... I may really place all the blame on Freyr. This war started long before his arrival. But he had the power to heal this land after the war, did he not? He made his choice. The wrong one. For Alfine, perhaps, but not necessarily for him. Well, I suppose we're all entitled to walk our own path, regardless of where they are. <laughs> Here, the last time we were here, we killed the Dark Elf King. That's unfortunate. I'd wondered what became of Svarty Offer. We had to defend ourselves, but when he died, he told us we helped the wrong side. I see. It's not the wrong angle. Oh shit. Probably the right one, but they have uh, to attack at this angle, I think. Yeah, I know it. Fine job, brother. This way, we're almost there. still hear something wounded out there, Atreus. I think so. It could just be the storm. Perhaps we can investigate once we've uncovered a mysterious seer's hidden prophecy. There. The central chamber will bring us to the top. Once we find our way past yet another light door. quite nicely with the Twilight Stone. A knack for interiors, these light elves. Ah, 
facing the wrong way. No shit. Hmm. Maybe if we allow me to speed this up. The angle should work, Kratos. Well done. At your service. Ah, oh, the light of Alfheim. How stunning. Jump! Your father is indeed thorough. Your father is indeed thorough. Limitless. Limitless sport. Power? Growth? Ambition? It's a bit vague, isn't it? mother inside last time but I can't anymore her soul is one with the light now united by forces older than Odin himself she is at peace Atreus I hope so when father went inside the light he you said went he... inside the light of Alfheim yes and yet here you stand of sound mind and decidedly not incinerated you must tell me Kratos what did you see that memory is for me alone but I felt only moments pass. Didn't feel like moments to me. I was trapped. Petraeus overcame great odds to save me. One could but only imagine. Well then, Groa's triptych awaits. Give us a so, boss fight. Did you ever meet Groa? Many times. But she was plagued by constant visions, so conversation was difficult. To say the least. Graphics, look at the armor. Oh shit. What are you doing? I heard something. Father, she's she's gone. Almost there. Huh. They've changed some stuff. Last time, there was all this high stuff up here. So many dark elves. I... All this time, I thought the dark elf came. I thought all the dark elves were... Tear? Yes? Did we help the wrong side? Hmm. Are you certain that's the right question? I... What's the right question? Is there a right side? Exactly. What do you think, Atreus? Is there a right side in this war? I... I don't know. Then perhaps you shouldn't pick one. Ah!
think something will come out of this. This is where we're going. The shrine is right there. Yeah, but there was a Nornier chest down here last time. <laughs> Nornier chest. Oh, I guess they moved it. I guess they moved it. That's funny. There it is. Ah, you all made it. Welcome. Do you believe in fate, Sindri? Oh, of course not. You think I'd wash my hands this much if I thought that what I do doesn't ultimately matter? There's only one thing with any say over how we live our lives, and that's us. Hey, Sindri, wasn't your forge on the other side of the shrine last time? My, someone's got an eye for detail. Perhaps the Light Elves felt it looked better on this side. They do have a thing for aesthetics. Honestly, I'm as puzzled as you are. But it's best not to look a gift forge in the two year. Very messy. Anyway, good luck. No, oh, I don't have any more dwarven steel. Did you, um, disinfect these? It's fine. I'll do it. <laughs> the giants always did enjoy hiding their secrets in plain sight. Wait until you see this. You see this? Jeez. Ah, yes. Here we have Groa's search for her missing husband. She was relentless in her attempt to find him. Meditated for weeks on end. Unfortunately, she found something else a vision of Ragnarok. Word of Groa's vision reached Odin. He sought her out, demanded a private retelling. Didn't like what he had, apparently. Ironwood? That's the... Uh... I don't know what that is. The mythical sanctuary for giants. Curious. So it's in Jotunheim? I know some giants thought so, but Ironwood isn't anywhere, lad. It's a concept, a metaphorical paradise. It's not real. Presumably, Groa requested her ashes be returned to Jotunheim while her soul found peace in the light. Difficult to imagine Odin respecting those wishes. Hmm. The champion? I think it's supposed to be... me. You assume too much. Aye. Best not to read into these abstractions so literally. Prophecies are slippery by nature. Although, some are more obvious than others. Ragnarok. Aye. The end of everything. So this is it. There's nothing we can do to stop it. There must be a way. Why else is this hidden? Look, here. This is what we saw. It's you, fighting in Ragnarok. No. I don't... I can't. What's this then? That's new. Asgard is destroyed? New realm. But the other realms thrive? And Odin died. 
is. She lied. Roa lied. Of course she did. <laughs> Odin's working off a false prophecy. <laughs> so then, we can win Ragnarok. We can beat Odin. We are not present in any of this. But that was Tyr leading the charge against Asgard. Plus, Hell's army was there. And the elves. Champion. Okay. Whoever that is, doesn't matter. But for the first time, we know something Odin doesn't. We just saw we can win. Tyr? I won't allow prophecy to define my choices. But, but we just saw No, you. Atreus. This is wrong. Kill Tyr. Oh. There is much to discuss. can't stop Ragnarok, but we can win it. If Asgard is destroyed, <laughs> Odin will not be the only casualty. There must be another way. <laughs> Perhaps we should focus on our egress first. Agreed. One of those light bombs! Careful! <laughs> <laughs> ah, give him what for! Where's the other one? Now. 
now before more arrive. <laughs> We need to keep moving. It's really worked up. I think he's okay? Focus, Atreus. Can I not go there? Close. It's over. Let's go. She's using the light to heal herself. Ah, you're dead, fucker. Here? Are you okay? No. It is over. It is far from over. I... It's gonna be okay, Tyr. You've seen what is to come. I told you I would not follow you to war, and yet here I am, dragging an innocent, innocent? elf and marching towards the destruction of Asgard. What choice do we have? There is always a choice. I will not lead you to war. I won't. I'm not that god anymore. I don't want to fight. But with you three, there is no avoiding it. Your path leads to countless deaths unimaginable pain and suffering. 
What a fucking wimp. Oh no! No! Atreus! Oh. Ah. Hold on! Over here! You're chained! I wonder hey, how powerful tear? is Tear. Thanks. And I'm sorry about before. I, I... No. I am sorry. I should never have come. You shouldn't linger. supposed to do roll over do nothing enough we will discuss our next move when we are out of danger Just leave us alone. Through 
See how powerful Tear is. Let's keep moving. is intense, huh? In the gateway, please. How about you wait? Ah. Can I still go through here? Oh, not anymore.
living desert. Huh. It was once full of life, you know. And music. The song of the sands, we called it. <laughs> Gone now. Another victim. Alright, let's uh Yourself the legacy this one has left for the barons. I've had far more than I can stomach. We do not need to rush. We should see this desert for ourselves. Look, I know we can't trust prophecy, but I'm not sure we should just ignore what we saw either. We are not ignoring it. We will discuss it back home. For now, I wish to search for the wound. Right, hello, hello. You? Really? Yes. Well, okay then. Good. Yeah, lead the way. think of cooking meat with those blades of yours? No. They would foul the meat. Oh, because of the magic on them? The blood. Ah, yes. The blood. Carry on then. Oh, look, there's a raven. that bug alone <laughs> no here we go three two one fuck <laughs> Atreus heard a creature in pain in the desert. Over a storm like this? Most impressive. You know Alfheim pretty well, right? Do you have any idea what's out there? No, sorry. The elves and I... Long story, but it's best when we keep out of each other's way. Hive matter is... stickier than I care for. Good luck on your search, though. Okay. Stuff some cloth in your ears to keep the sand out. Don't knock it till you've tried it. All right, let's do it. First, let's uh, refresh our health. If I don't have it, you don't need it. This axe just keeps getting stronger. Hmm. Have we more to talk about? What the fuck? What are these animals? Go on. Native to Vanaheim. Not sure what they're doing here. Why were we given lions? Someone trained them to pull a sled. Lucky for us. Domesticated gulag. Most unusual. Can we stop? Oh. Nice. <laughs> Uh, 
like the wolves. Any particular direction to find your wounded animal? Or are we just enjoying the weather? I can't hear anything out here. Perhaps we find a cave first to catch our bearings? A tempting treasure chest! Damn the sand! Oh, we can't get it yet, huh? Yep, we can't get that. Shattered room. Not getting up there with all this sand in your way. I think I have to to continue this, like the sand shit. I think I have to kill. Maybe I have to kill creature. So much sand. I don't think we're getting through that gate in the storm. There's something, there's a stage like this, right? In the original trilogy. Whatever this thing is, I think the animal's inside. Whatever's inside is kicking up quite a bit of sand. How do we reach it? There's caves and tunnels are plenty out here. Let's find one and see where it takes us. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Annoying that Kratos moves so slow sometimes. Fuck. Brother, get up. <laughs> On you left. Get 
Die, bitch! Jesus Christ, that was a weird fight. those ravens back to Nifelheim. What's that? A diagram for a sword hilt. Perhaps we should show it to one of the dwarves. They'll know what to do with it. Sword hilt. What's this? Okay, so this is not way where we're supposed to go. But we got some good loot. Here we go. This is the the place where Aladdin found the the lamp, right? <laughs> Maybe the genies in here. Give me another health burst. be under leveled for this area maybe look here but I don't want to waste my resources like leveling up a bad item right you're building quite the collection of poetry brother why so surprised my people are known for their culture. Not surprise. Esteem. Dogs of war. Is this 
is not it, right? We could always go to this marker. Something I should uh, go to. <gasps> Eighty three meters, huh? Look, there's a cave entrance. Where? Where? Underneath the desert is the creature within. Yeah, sounds like it. We'll find it if we keep going. What is this place? A refuge for the dark elves, by the looks of it. One of the few remaining knows of a bard from the temple. Great. Stone give you the angle you need, brother. Yeah, nice hint. Huh?
that's interesting. Can I destroy this? Patience. A virtue or a threat? Depends on the reader. <laughs> Dwarven steel, interesting. Okay, let's go up. I think it's. I think the game wants us to do side quests before we continue with the game or something, right? The creature you heard. What does it say now? It's not always like that. Some animals are just... I feel what they're feeling, you know? No. Whatever this thing is, it's in a lot of pain. I see. Why do you ask? I am curious. Really? I am capable of curiosity. Okay. <laughs> I am capable okay. of curiosity. Get it. Let's find the... Uh... So there's one. One. There's something here. Oh, there we go. So we can't get that yet. I'm just trying to figure out why you'd help some random animal. Is this not what you want? No, no, it, it is. I'm just surprised it's what you want, too.
Easy. Whom, until this very moment, would take on an army of Draugr to save a wounded animal. But these aren't undead Draugr. They're elves. I just want to make sure we're not repeating the same mistakes. Getting involved where we shouldn't. I wonder, what if Kratos was this mature during the first three games?
Okay. You know, s s these puzzles annoy me sometimes. Sometimes you just want to progress through the game. Right? Makes you wonder if there are some things that you have to complete first before you can continue to an area. Alright, give me a couple of seconds, guys. It's weird that Kratos can't climb. the one who drags us around trying to rescue animals. Why do you care so much? Is there something you're not telling me? No. Okay. <laughs> Let's check anyway. Oh! Wait. 
Wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> baby I find it weird that we can't continue with the story unless you kill all enemies. It's their own. I don't know why they designed it. It's not possible to uh, skip combat. not just in pain it's trying to sing it's the song of the sands you don't normally sing like this underground is that what's causing the storm aye judging by all this hive matter weighing it down it's been trapped here for dozens of winters don't worry Lynch. we'll get you out what is that name well the last good thing we saw was Diener, so oh boy well i appreciate the attempt at humor that little brother is truly awful wordplay. Embarrassing, really. Oh, well, can't all be winners. <laughs> Embarrassing wordplay. There's got to be a way to clear those rocks. Get a better angle. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Next. Okay, there's 
something here. Yeah. Out. Much of the hive matter is gone. We can free it from the surface now. Why did they trap it down here? Hathkafas are known to burrow. So I'd hesitate to place full blame on our dark elf friends. But it's trapped in their hive stuff. Hive matter doesn't belong to the dark elves. Any more than the light belongs to the light elves. It's just another of Alfheim's natural resources. One the Elves have used since the time of their ancestors. And while the Light Elves seem keen to banish the Hive over on their side, the Dark Elves make effective use of it out here in the Barrens. So, by clearing out all of this Hive, are we hurting Dark Elves? You wish to leave the creature enslaved. <sighs> then let us free it. This is the spot! We can cut the half poofa loose here! God damn! It's a half goofa. That's fucking much happier now. huge. And hey, the storm's gone. Aye, perhaps we'll finally earn some goodwill from our dark elf friends after all. Look, father, thanks for bringing us out here, but we don't have to do this kind of stuff just to keep my mind off Ragnarok, you know? This was not a distraction. No? Then why are we really out here? Have you ever considered? He just wants to spend time with you, lad. While he still can. Really? We do not know what lies ahead. But if Ragnarok approaches, I wish to enjoy the time we have left. Oh. I... I don't know what to say. Thank you for bringing us out here. I'm glad we did this. As am I. <laughs> Still have much to do. hear about his travels to the lands beyond the seas you wish to travel the world i don't know maybe see new places 
find out more about myself. Should we get back to listing all the awful deeds of the Acer gods? Who else? Ah, room near the brawler. Stone giant. Aye, mocked by Odin, murdered by Thor. Enough of this. But there's more. I do not care. War with Odin is not the answer. Looks like a lot of the sand is cleared up. But there's another storm out that way. I think that means... Another half, Gufa. The chisel will not open this. Did the lighthouse put this lock here? Why would they care what happens in the barrens? A fair question. But until we find the right key, that poor half Gufa will have to continue its solo act. <laughs> Found another chest earlier. Oh, here it is. Uh, what is it, Lumia? That's nothing, brother. Just you ever have those moments where you wish you could go back? Rewrite your own past. Make different decisions. Journeying through time is more trouble than it's worth. Ah, uh, fair point. You're speaking metaphorically, right? No. Of course you're not. Of course you're not. Because we did time travel. Something I'm not sure I quite understand. In the Ragnarok prophecy Odin knows, all the realms get destroyed, including Asgard. In the version Groa kept secret, Asgard still falls. Didn't Odin have to prevent it either way? What difference did her life really make? Old. We will finish later. Why can't Kratos throw it? Like with the with the fucking angle, right? Did it. Father, what's the biggest thing you've ever fought? I do not know. You can't remember? Why do you ask? I don't know. So we do compare? It is not a competition. I mean, not yet. I think this is a boss fight, like an arena. These rooms. This looks like an arena. Right? Oh. 
Lucius. I've been considering your question about whether Groa's deception made a difference. I think of it this way. When it comes to subverting prophecy, knowledge is power. Without the full picture and context, the finer details can lead you to tragically incorrect interpretations. Back in my homeland, I was privy to the operations of a certain coven of witches who were keen on destabilizing the government. They picked an influential thane, an otherwise loyal man, and fed him a story of his own ascension to king. They dressed it up in enough detail they knew would come to pass, so when they did, the thane took it as confirmation. Next thing you know, he's helping matters along. He murders his king, sleeping under his own roof. Let this wait. Stay alert. Well, something there. Let's see if uh, we can... Let's check this area out. Sort of a harp. I can play beautifully, you know. I do not. I would prefer it remain that way. Oh. deal with Odin's ravens. They can just transport him anywhere? Except for the realm between realms, thankfully. Why? Harder to find, thanks to dwarven enchantments and Yggdrasil's very own nature. Hmm. Lucky us. <laughs> I think that's it. Right? Let's just continue the story from... I think we could continue the story now. Back to my story. A thane of my homeland, manipulated by prophecy, welcomes his king as a guest and murders him in his sleep. Murders many he once called friends too, thinking them fated to oppose him. Then, for a finishing touch, the witches revisit this usurper. With just a few details structured ever so misleadingly, they convinced the fool he was invulnerable to all threats. Physical, Physical or magical. magical. Aye, aye, but twas not so for him. All turned into a rather magnificent bloodbath as they go. The Thane ends up without his head and a name so cursed, none dare speak it. All thanks to a subtly deceptive prophecy. We really gotta write these stories down one day, Mimir. Well, I try. Jaw tends to get sore, but thank you, I. Mimir, a little while ago you mentioned Odin's raven. What's to stop him from using them to pop into existence and kidnap anybody he wants? Consent. The only way to travel by Odin's ravens is by your own choice. No, oh, it's not so bad then. Another one? I think we find found that. <gasps> anyway. Can we go to Muspelheim now? Well, I 
hope Tyr's had enough time to find his equilibrium, or whatever. Indeed. I saw flashes of the old god of war in them, but they were fleeting. There is nothing wrong with opposing war, nor opposing prophecy. I suppose that's fair. Never can be quite sure what the Giants meant by any of it. Am I the only one that remembers they predicted our entire journey to Jotunheim? If the Giants saw Tyr leading armies at Ragnarok, then I believe them. The question is, how you'll ever make Tyr believe it? you back, young one. Come help me, won't you? Oh, sure. We can eat whenever you like, Kratos. The stew will only improve with time. Glad you're in a better mood. Yes. I was a little overwhelmed before. Forgive me. It's funny. Nothing seems to settle my mind quite like cooking. Being locked up for so long. You know what he's putting in that so-called stew of his, don't you? Vegetables! Fucking vegetables! From <laughs> out of the dirt! That just ain't right. Relics. What else can we power up?
dress. Eat. Oh, careful, careful. Thank you. Enjoy. Enjoy, my friends. Yeah. We'll see about that. Here you are. A meal fit for a champion. Enough. I said we would speak no more of that. Yes, of course. Didn't mean to offend. Uh, I'm not offended. It's just a word. The word didn't cloud your judgment. So, you really don't think it means anything? After the journey Mom sent us on? Everything we saw in Jodenheim? What was it all for? Don't you ever think about that? Every day. I cannot believe her purpose was to inspire you to take foolish risks. Well, what if the giants are counting on me? What giants? I counting on you. To be safe. To be smart. But use the judgment of a man and not of a child. But what if Loki going to Ironwood is the only way that you Oh, Atreus. My son. I'm not hungry anymore. Forgive me, Kratos. My words were chosen carelessly. Oh no, we're gonna use the trace again. Mm. You really should eat. Some people swear by it. On almost a daily basis. I just don't understand. Why is there all this stuff about Loki and, and the champion and Ironwood if none of it's real? He's just so... Mind if I give you the best advice you've heard all day, and possibly ever? Sleep. That's when all yeah, the, the stream is fucking up. Sorry, guys. Out. Facebook is doing its thing again. Sure. Fine. Sleep. Sounds great. I mean it. I do too. Get out of here, Idy. Already gone. those stones do gonna end the stream there guys I'll see you again later maybe later maybe soon but I have to stop the stream the stream is fucking up again thank you Facebook for doing that <laughs> all right guys thank you this is uh, one of the longer streams hope you had fun I did huh all right I'll see you again soon guys bye